Okay, let's see. Now that we've gone in through the uh, time, sir, uh, we've gone, we've sped things up a little. Uh, let's see if maybe if the new server has um has mentioned uh, something about this. Uh, about how that was how we deleted all those files. Heck, I don't know if it's even in there, but uh, I don't want to bother looking through all of them. Oh, uh, you haven't heard of it yet? Guess it's not there yet. Hey, wait a minute. What's this say? There's something lower here. Andromeda Research Corporation, otherwise known as ARC, have been extremely busy lately. The company has been hiring all of the top uplink agents for the past couple of weeks, sometimes posting several missions in one day. They haven't hired me! <laughs> they wouldn't know a top uplink agent if... I were one, which I am! Details are thin, but it appears that the work done is very vague in nature. ARC are keeping quiet about the ultimate goal of this work, and all the agents involved are sworn to secrecy. Analysts predict that ARC has spent over 50,000 credits in the last week alone on agent fees. At the time of the writing, ARC was unwilling to comment. Is that, um, A-R-C or is it pronounced ARC? Have I been mispronouncing it? I hope I haven't been misdenouncing it. Now let's go back to these uh, things we've wanted to do. Here's some global criminal database ones. So let's, uh, let's hack into them. Hacking into the global criminal database is a lot like hacking into the international social security thing for a simple reason. Uh, pretty much it's the same thing every time. You're sure sometimes you're clearing a criminal record and sometimes you're getting someone arrested and sometimes you're adding something to someone's criminal record, but really it's the same uh, thing. And it's pretty simple. You connect. Blah, 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 blah. Well. Uh, pretty simple. Let's just do a proxy bypass. Since when you're first going to be hacking here, well, you're not likely to have all this stuff, so you might have to use the proxy disable. So I won't bother with the mon- What the frickin' what the- What the heck just happened there? What the, did the... Why was it doing that? It, you heard that also. It was going... As if I was about to be caught, but there... I couldn't have been. I routed it through all this stuff. I'm so confused. Okay, let's, let's just go with the password breaker. Now let's uh, bypass the proxy server. Okay, now we need to get... Now, it's pretty, pretty simple so far. Next up, we need to use the decipher. We need to go over here and just decipher our way through. Now, if you're not fast enough, like maybe your uh, gateway is slow, you might need to make two trips. One to get through this, and the other to get through the password breaker. Because luckily, it unbelievably will save the fact that it's access granted as long as you haven't done the other. So now we're here and we can search records. So it's pretty simple. Again, like the International Social Security Database. Okay, so here we need to do something for Dan Miller. As it says here. Give him a conviction for robbery. Okay, robbery! Now we send this and get the money. Now this is a different one. In this case, as you can check over here, we need to clear the criminal record. So, search records again. For Ian Woods. Clear history. What else do we have? That's pretty much it. You can also authorize people's arrests. If you give them two prior convictions and breaking parole, you can arrest them! <laughs> so if there's someone you don't like, go ahead and do it. But you guys know me, I would never be that cruel. Well, not unless someone was paying me. Okay, 
So this has been, whoops, wrong one actually. Let me see. Yeah. Okay, uh, where were we? Admin. Perfect. Okay, now what? We've still got three missions left to do. Hmm. Well, we've already done this one. We're just waiting for it to actually bother to show up in the news. You know, the future of the news is slow. I mean, nowadays... I mean, just... We've got 24-hour news channels. This kind of thing wouldn't it be right up there immediately? Unless there are so many hackings that they just don't do that. That they are too busy to get all of them. Well, whatever. Here's another one. MediaNet Microsystems, blah, blah, blah. Uh, where is the... I uh, hear... Uh, no, wait, that's not it, is it? No, we're looking for the MediaNet Microsystems Internal Services Machine. Where is it? It should be colored green. No, this is the International Bank. You know, and this is the... Another green one is that... Ah, here it is! How did I miss that? Curse you green for blending in! This one is... Well, pretty much the same thing. Hey, remember how a while ago they said you may encounter firewalls or proxies? Pit, <laughs> they were lying. So again, we just gotta delete everything. Go to the console, go to CDUSR, delete. Whoa, 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 did I start singing again? Oh, well, uh, you probably wouldn't, didn't like that much. Okay, so once again, it's deletion time for the logs. Okay, pretty uh, simple, isn't it? Now it's time for our uh, final hack for these things. Well, we don't, we can delete these now. And, well, we've already done these one of these before, but let's check it out again. Okay, pretty simple. We gotta go into the MediaNet Microsystems Bank. Simple enough. Uh, which is... I forgot. Oh, here it is. And it's existing account, and it's, uh... 3904575 as usual the password breaker but first let's uh, bypass a monitor okay view statement okay whoa that's a lot of money transfer to 692.679.632.619 account 2765731 Perfect. Go over here, go to Internic again. Let's check out the IP address. Um, it was 692.679.632.619. Video Solutions International Bank. Which one is that? What, Ivan? You cannot modify an existing... Oh, I need to disconnect and then I can load. Okay, Video Systems International Bank. Where is that? Ugh, I always have trouble finding these things. Video Systems, Video Systems, Video Systems... Video systems, where are you video systems? 
Well, we'll find it next time. See ya!